in the article page we can see the articles we have set so far and similarly as the problem setting we can edit an article clone an article delete an article or we can just add a new article so if i go to a previous article from here i can go to edit page as you can see first we need to give the title then the subtitle then if we want we can add some components to this article like markdown or a problem or a solution let's demonstrate on clicking markdown we can add the markdown content similarly on clicking clicking a problem we will get a canvas like this where we can set a problem for the users here also we have the same options like canvas solution test similar to the problem setting side then we have the option to to make a solution for the canvas so now how we will make the solution so as we have seen lastly that we can take snapshot so if i as a setter if i just solve the problem and take a step by step snapshot then i can upload the image in the solution editor component let's see here first i have taken the initial step then the next then in this way i will take step by step snapshots then i will just upload them in my solution editor component here i have the option to add a new image or delete an existing image then save the can solution as you can see if we just delete this and add a new one what we have just saved will get back what we have deleted so this is the way we are doing that So this is the article part here also if we save the article we will the an approval request would be sent to the admin and he will have the option to approve the article or not okay so this is what i have to show you about the setter side now i will go to the admin side let's log out okay so we are not giving any options to the user to access the admin site we will access this directly from the url okay so this is the admin login page if i just log in first of all i have the option to edit the topics then series then canvases then problem approval then contest approval then article approval then setter approval let's see one by one okay so first of all here is the list of our topics we have in our website or we can add a new topic if we want so on creating a new topic we will directly go to the edit page we can set a description then a url of the logo let's see an existing article before that here we have some options to edit what the user will see if we click on the edit button 
we can drag the topics card and control what in which order a user will see the topics so i can hide a topic or make it live from here or i can just delete the topic then i can discard what i have changes or i can save that so let's save that now on clicking a topic like this graph we can see that we have set the description url and then under that we have some series which we can also drag and drop and can maintain manage the order in which the series will be shown to the user here also we can hide the series or delete a series then save that topic on the series page we can see the list of all series we have created so far or we can just create a new series from here on creating a new series here also we have the options for series name description logo and then we have the option to add this series under a topic so I am adding this series under tree then I am saving this and we will just see a confirmation so this is how topic and series works then is our canvases here also you can add canvas or edit canvas let's see the graph canvas so here we need to set the canvas name then a class name which is needed in the front end to show the canvas basically the canvas is different for each type so from this class name we will render that class in the front end then we have some info for the users then logo url and last not but not least so this is the code which we have seen in the code editor so an admin can set the default code of a canvas from here then the edit options we have seen before directed edge weighted edge so the type of the option is it a switch or a select option or a number this can be customized from here or we can add a new option let's say switch now oh, let's say select okay so i have chosen the option select so in a select field we also have some choices for selection we need we need to set them so we can set the choices here one by one choice one create choice two in this way i can do that and i can choose a default choice then i can go to the preview options here also in the same way as we have seen in the setter side he has the option to add node delete node this is all customized from here then we can just save this canvas up next we have the problems here we have we can see that pre pending problems then approved problems so this is the problem just that i just have published so here i have the option to approve or reject so if i reject the problem so it will ask here for me a rejection reason so i can tell him that i can give some feedback or i can just keep this so a setter can see the feedback from his side which we will see in a minute okay so or i just i can just approve a problem after approving a problem 
I can I can also choose under which series the problem will go here I can see the topics then I can choose the series and I can just save the problem so in this way we will manage the problems in our website and then we have the contests here also if we have any pending contest we can approve it from here or after approving a contest we can change the date of the contest if we want or and we have also the options to mark the difficulty of the contest then we can schedule the contest after scheduling a contest if the contest is over we can publish the leaderboard and then the user contest rating will be updated and the leaderboard will be updated then we can see the articles from here we can just approve or reject article then on and we can assign the article under a series and lastly we have the setter page so what i have shown previously that when set setter signs up approval is sent to the admin so only if admin approves then setter can log into his account i can just reject or approve from here so this is all about the admin part